Hello. It's Chuseok vacation in South Korea. And what better way to celebrate than by going a trip with your friends? That's precisely what our Sri Lankan friends living in Korea had in mind when they planned this amazing adventure to the southern part of the country. As we always know how to have fun and make the most out of our trips, we find something a little different and memorable. That's why we decided to hire a van and drive it on this long distance trip together. As you can see, the ride was full of fun and laughter. Driving the van together was a blast. We took turns behind the wheel and enjoyed each other's company as we explored the beautiful countryside of the South Korea. But the fun didn't stop there. We took the first stop as initially planned at the Hezing Bank Park. And notice that we are gonna be the first visitors of the day as it was not open yet. Anyway, we were super duper hungry because the journey started around 2 a.m. from Ulsan and we have been traveling many miles. So we just sat in this shady place in front of the park and enjoyed our delicious Sri Lankan breakfast. So the first day trip breakfast is bread with homemade dal curry and the most special pulsam bowl which reminds us of the flavors of old Sri Lankan homes. Surprisingly, our friend Dinusha brought some Indian style short eats as well. There was a chili coconut mixture to eat them, which we are very familiar with. It was spicy but at the same time very very delicious. We started walking to the Hezing Sang Park, which made us laugh again. This unique destination is home to a collection of phallic shaped statues and it has an interesting story behind it. It's a must see destination for visitors to Gang Wan though. For those who may need to become more familiar with Chuseok, let me give you a brief rundown. Chuseok is a major mid-autumn harvest festival. It's one of the biggest holidays in Korea celebrated in late summer. And it's time for the families to come together, pay respects to their ancestors and enjoy traditional food and activities. Welcome to Hezing Bank Park, also known as the Penas Park. Now before you start laughing and blushing, let me explain the story behind this unusual name. First, have a look. Legend has it that a virgin bride drowned in the nearby sea while waiting for her lover to return from the sea causing the fish to disappear and the local fishermen to suffer from lack of livelihood. To appease the spirit of the virgin bride and bring back the fish, the villagers decided to build carvings and offer them to the sea. And thus, Hesing Deng Park was born. Nowadays, it's a popular tourist destination and Instagram hotspot where you can find hundreds of wooden and stone penises of all shapes and sizes. Also, the park is believed to be a place of good luck and fertility. So if you are in the mood for a good laugh and some unusual photo ops, make sure to add Hezing Bank Park to your itinerary. Just don't forget to bring your sense of humor an open mind. This is the psycho Michelle fight for the white girl. This one for the hood girls, them hood girls, straight masterpiece. Styling, smiling, living it up in a city. 
Got chunks on with San Laurent. Got a gas mask so pretty. Too hot. Hot damn. Throw a lease and a fireman. Too hot. Hot damn. Make a dragon want to retire, man. Too hot. Hot damn. Say my name and know who I am. I'm too hot. Hot damn. Make a bad about that money. Break it down. Girl said you hallelujah. Ooh. Girl said you hallelujah. Ooh. Girl said you hallelujah. Cause Uptown Funk gon' give it to ya Cause Uptown Funk gon' give it to ya After our fun-filled morning at Hazengdang Park, we decided to head to the art museum. We spent a beautiful day there. But our adventure was far from over. Join us next time as we continue our Chuseok road trip through Gangwando, South Korea. <laughs>